Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Its name is My Wave. And now in this video, we are working on the footer area and the fourth part of the footer. Now, I am going to create uh, a notifi notification bar. Okay? No, not a notification bar. It's a, it's a notification subscription, uh, something like subscription box. Okay? So, when you text editor, and now you can select the div class footer sub 3. Okay? So, take a input box and the type will be text. Okay? And the name will be subs. And the placeholder is. write your email okay now control to save and check in the browser again control to refresh okay you can see it and first of all uh, write the take a heading h2 Subscribe us. Okay, control us to save and again check. Okay, it's working. And yeah, copy this class. Control C to copy this class and come to the style of CSS. And again, that dot for class and control to paste and take with with will be okay. Do hey, it's a twenty percent. And it's a twenty-five percent. So yeah, thirty-five percent. Okay. And float left. Okay. Control to save and again check in the browser. Refresh. Okay. And check in the center. So again, come to index.html. Copy the whole thing, the H2 and control X to cut and then write the center and paste in between in the center tag. Control V to paste. Okay, control X to save and again check in the browser. Press. Okay, now customize the styling of this input tag. So come to here and again come to install the CSS. dot footer sub underscore 3 and the input ok or you can say that uh, take a input class so the class subs ok now come to here and dot subs and middle bracket open and I'm taking the width first okay the width will be uh, 300 pixel okay control is to save okay now I'm going to press the control alt plus s for save both files okay now again refresh this it's working and change the border and the height and also yeah everything, everything is good so the border will be none the height is 50 pixel control to save and then check in the browser refresh and take a padding Adding will be 15 pixel. Control share and check in the browser refresh. Now, take a search box button. So, again, change the line and take a input. Type submit 
and the name submit okay sub okay uh, yeah submit underscore button and the value uh, subscribe okay and the class sub underscore btn and close control to save and again refresh now you can see that there is the subscribe button in the class what i take a class name sub underscore button so dot sub underscore button and middle bracket open and the height will be 50 pixel border will be none and the background hash 1a sorry 1 triple a 1a okay control save and check in the browser again refresh and float left control to save and refresh and also here to float left in the dot subs and I mean to say in the input box text control to save and refresh and yeah change the width or 15 pixel control to save and refresh and the footer sub 3 and of here okay it's working done and come to the index.html file and write a paragraph and write some paragraph yeah. enter your email id for get notification by us okay and dot conclude to save and check in the browser again refresh okay and now take a class sub underscore p and now control to save and come to the installed css and okay what i take, write sub underscore dot dot sub underscore p and middle bracket open and the color will be hash triple nine font style italic okay control to save and check in the browser refresh and font size is 10 pixel control to save check the browser again refresh oh oops the, it's a 12 pixel now check in the browser 15 control to save and refresh okay it's looking good and now our uh, e-commerce home page is ready and if you want to make to a responsive web page so please subscribe and subscribe my youtube channel and share and write your comment for make this responsive so now this is our, our final and last video of this video series and now in the next video uh, next video series will be announced, announced by me so happy say with me happy coding yeah.